Louise Thompson is too scared to read the investigation into the traumatic birth of her child. The former Maid in Chelsea star, 32, says she received a report with details thicker than the entire works of Shakespeare earlier this week but hasn't been able to bring herself to open it yet, almost a year on from welcoming her first child into the world. Louise and her fiancé Ryan Libby become parents to a little miracle baby in November 2021, naming the top Leo Hunter Libby, but their son's arrival saw mother and baby dancing with death following a dramatic labor, with Louise still suffering from major health complications to this day. The reality TV star kept the arrival of her firstborn private for five weeks as she very almost didn't make it home for Christmas, after various serious complications left her confined to a wheelchair and recovering in hospital for a month post-birth. Louise has been open and honest about her physical and mental health battles since the birth of her first child as she continues on her recovery and attends multiple hospital appointments in a bid to discover what went wrong last year and return to full health. Taking to her Instagram stories on Tuesday, September 13, the mom of one told her followers how she was off for the first scan of her pelvis in three months, after opting to go private due to NHS waiting times not having any time slots available for several more months. En route to a medical facility on Harley Street in a taxi, Louise explained how she still doesn't have any answers about what's going on in that region and her last ultrasound was inconclusive but the guy joked there was something white and shiny in there. Going on to share a snap of her trainers next to her Chanel handbag. Louise confessed to her followers she doesn't know why she looks to them for answers as they don't know the full extent of what happened yet, and neither does she. I actually received an investigation report with details thicker than the complete works of Shakespeare the other day but I've been too scared to open it, she admitted to her fans on Monday. I was also scheduled to have a private hysteroscopy, small camera inside in July but it coincided with my readmission to hospital for my ulcerative colitis, so it's been put on the back burner," she continued, before poignantly adding, sometimes I can't believe this is my life. In December last year, just two days before Christmas Day, new mom Louise announced the arrival of her bundle of joy on Instagram and revealed the happy news she was being discharged from hospital to continue her recovery at home. Five weeks ago I gave birth to my beautiful baby boy Leo Hunter Libby weighing in at 7 pounds. Unfortunately it wasn't the easiest start for either of us. One ended up in NICU and the other ended up in ICU, she explained to her Instagram followers at the time. Louise went on to confirm Leo Hunter made a fairly quick recovery but she was left battling so many bad things and admitted the experience has changed her outlook on life. To dance with death twice brings a whole new view of the world, she candidly admitted in her post. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at Web Celebs at Mirror. UK or call us direct at 0207 29 Read more latest showbiz stories Geordie Shore's Chloe Ferry has SPL Paul Walker's daughter Meadow shares Chloe Ferry unrecognizable from TVD Charlotte Crosby forced to do baby N